Hey guys, uh, so quick video. Every year, there's always a handful of people as they start the gym, it might be their first time lifting and they get there and they start freaking out a little bit. They're like, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know, uh, this feels weird. Da, da, da. Think about when you first started cycling, right? You had your bright Nash bar vest on. I was rocking basketball shorts. You don't know like how to shift. Everything's new. You watch other people, you ask questions, you watch videos, you study it. That's how you need to approach lifting, right? This isn't a natural thing for most cyclists. I know a lot of our athletes lift year round now. They see the benefits in it. But if you're new to it, we were new to it as well at once. And you need to look at it like anything new that you do. It's gonna feel weird, it's gonna feel different. The biggest thing, number one, form. You wanna make sure you're doing these the right way. So if something feels weird, you're probably doing it wrong. Um, it might feel like a different movement. The deadlift is a different, like a hip hinge. That's a different movement we don't necessarily think of doing. Excuse me. Um, so number one is form. Number two, the weight will come, right? People get in the gym and they're like, oh, well, this thing said that I was supposed to do five more pounds today or 10 more pounds today. So they force it and that's when you get injured. If you went out on a bike ride and you just couldn't hit your watts, you'd still go as hard as you could. You'd still try to get the, you're getting time in the zone. So today I went and if I wanted to deadlift, I'm not that good at it. So say 170 pounds and I was like, nah, that's, that's just, I could tell when I was warming up, I warm up at like 120, 130. I wasn't gonna be able to hit that. I stopped at 155. Still getting massive benefit from that but you don't force things. So number two, don't force things. Number three, the exercises that we give you are based off of ones that are applicable for cycling. So deadlift, squat, overhead press, um, the lat pull down, the lunges, but there are so many variations of this. And if you see someone doing something, your friends doing something, don't feel like you can't integrate it or that like, just like the training program in cycling, in training peaks is not the bible right we like shift things around we work with your life schedule we do things that are personal to you lifting can be the same way so you might um feel that you have an imbalance in something then you want to try something else you want to get on a bosu ball you need more work on stability or this or that these are things that remember we can't really see in training peaks so keep the communication going through the power phase program so that we know what works but doesn't work it's there's no file really you know it's hard. so just remember that um but keep it safe you're gonna get tons of benefit from it and lifting heavy stuff is gonna help you take your game to the next level